first here against the generals who looks like they may be getting caught out again there's a nice follow-up from no cake the damage is there and force flashes forward and gets the double kill absolutely filthy stuff 2019 <laughs> This certainly isn't going to be one the generals will forget anytime soon. So here we go, 2v4. Can they pull it off? Of course they can! And for Sneez Gunner gets the double, making a triple! And Tablo tries to crawl away from the carnage. He'll get the stun in. And for will he be denied? Gosh, it's forward. Get the Quadra! And BTC! Find scout of the week though from Crouching Jaeger, but that is going to be four members down here. Void Seeker lands, crew look for the killer instinct. Glacial Frizz again, do they need it too? Nitro do through the dirt, so is best for EU. The Resurrect used to help tank up the tower. Converting to GYU about 4k in turn for top side, but the fight starts and GYU has to flash away with the hate bar down. Starrett is part of Turtlock and very low. So much damage comes through on Turtlock trying to escape and GYQ is left to be unstoppable. Not take falls down as well, but not quite. He survives. Jin, Alphors with a triple, making the Jin Penta for sure if he can land the deadly flourish. But there's no stun to be found and no cake survived. I have with the Ganon Barrage and the True Shot Barrage. Clay for prison in turn, now Knife do take it so desperately low. The pop from the ultimate reactivation in Kodo gets that one. They'll get a second of GYQ is dead again. Now down goes him, but it's a one versus four. And he gets popped by Ambos who turned it around. Who's the real assassin here? And the one with the sniper rifle, I tell you. And now Alpha is left alone to try and survive. Deadly Thrice comes through and the rooted in place to further front afterwards. Means it's another triple for Ambos.